What is up guys, it is me Nathan from Sweaty, and we are back with more Moxie Monsters at the Lost Landscapes. Today we are going to be doing some extremely exciting stuff, and it's going to be over on Gamma Water Island, which is currently actually in development, so all this progress is eventually going to be reset, but that's okay because we're checking it out today. The other day, I got the first monster on this island, it's called Olgara Pipe, and it's really cool. Look at it, it's awesome. It's the Toe Jammer monster on this island, which, let me explain what I mean. There's three monsters on this island. There's the Olgara Pipe, Kelpable, and Jastanon. They're all very, very cool. The way you get these monsters is you have to get a certain monster from Floating City and then teleport it to here by leveling it up to level 20 and putting it in the Zeppelin. This one was Toe Jammer, this one is going to be Potbelly, and this one's going to be Quibble. So we're going to be getting Potbelly and Quibble today. And look at these monsters, they're so cool. But we're going to take a better look at them once we get them on the island. So I actually already prepared in my live stream earlier for this video. So we're already pretty much ready to get it right off the start. The only things we need is we need the Zeppelin over here. So let's bring the Zeppelin over here. And there's actually something unfortunate right now going on. I have my Zeppelin going to Calamity Island for basically no reason. I don't even know why it's, I sent it here. It was an accident. but So we have to waste 18 diamonds. There's nothing in there, like I said, but whatever. It doesn't matter. We're just going to take it right back on to Floating City. And here are the two monsters. Like I said, we need Quibble and we need Potbelly. Quibble is already level 20. There we go. Send it to Zeppelin. And so is Potbelly. Like I said, I came to this video prepared. But now we need to send the Zeppelin on over to the island. I'm super excited for this because Gamma Water Island so full. So, so far sounds really awesome. And Ogar Pipe sounds great. So I'm sure the other two will also sound great. But here we go. I'm so excited. And also, let's take a look at the island because we didn't do that yet. Looks like we're in the middle of the ocean completely right here. And there's this big little thing in the middle. I don't know if that's like a rock or something or what exactly it is. Looks like a octopus, actually. There's like a squid that's holding this all up. I just realized that. Look at that. There's all these tentacles holding up these platforms. And then there's this big thing in the middle. That is interesting. This octopus is holding up this whole island or a squid, I guess. I don't know. But it kind of looks like this guy. Look at his tentacles. It's like a squid. Which, by the way, let's listen to this guy first. I know we've already listened to him a little bit, but if you listen to him right here, he sounds absolutely amazing. I love how he plays with the bass machine. Listen to how much the bass machine adds on this island, by the way. Do you hear it without the bass machine? It sounds pretty cool, but then with the bass machine, it just takes it to a whole nother level. It already sounds awesome, and we don't even have the other two monsters, so the whole song is going to be awesome. And I call it a whole song, like I said, this island is still in development. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a lot more monsters in the future, but for now we only have a few. And to get them, we're going to need to spend 24 more diamonds, which is a lot of diamonds spent in this video, but it's okay because later we're going to be working on something to make more diamonds. But okay, we have Jastin is what this one's called. And it's a weird, demented version of Quibble, because I'll read the bio of this monster to show you after we hear it, because there's something weird going on in Gamma Water Island. This island is not like a, any normal island you've seen before. And I'll, sh I'll show you, you'll see what I mean. But look at this thing, this thing is so weird. It's a You can see how it's related to Quibble. It's Quibble, it has its heads tied together though. They're like stuck together and it has these three tentacles. It looks like something is very wrong with it. But let's wait for it to sing, and maybe if, maybe I have to mute the other guys to hear him sing. I don't know. Fada, let's mute them. Whoa. Fada, 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 Whoa. Fada, 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 it has sharp fada, teeth. Fada, that fada, thing is scary, fada, bro. That is weird. Fada, fada, oh my gosh. It, fada, it has only fada, one fada, eye open at once fada, as well. It looks fada, like the left eye is open. Now, oh, both of them were open for a second, but look at those teeth. Whoa. I was honestly kind of expecting it to sing just like a quibble. I didn't expect its two heads to open up like that. That is weird. Does it play with a little garfight? Let's try to hear them together. Oh. Oh, they play together well. Okay, that is awesome. It'll be even more awesome with the final mo with the final monster. I was gonna say Potbelly and I almost said Motbelly. <laughs> I was mixing up Potbelly and Monster, but here we go. This one's called Kelpable, I believe. Look at him. He looks so happy. Look at his smile on his face. He looks a lot better. And when I say better, I mean like more happy. But oh my gosh. Did you hear that? <laughs> Okay, it's literally like little pot bellies on top of this monster. I 
Let's see to him with all guard private. Sounds so good together. And look, I love this design of the monster. Look, he looks so happy. Look at his little eyes and his smile. And his hands. He, this guy is awesome. He reminds me of Wooper from Pokemon. His face, at least. Look at it. This is so awesome. But now I'm going to show you what I was talking about. The bios of these things. Because these things are pretty weird. Look. Well, it seems that it's in a Quibble's DNA to demature into a strange creature whenever it's modified. Alike to a monster's long since extinct, such as the epic and prismatic Quibbles. It seems like something in this monster's elemental core caused it to turn into this. Worry not, because it doesn't seem like too painful of a condition. And it still loves to sing. Or is that a scream? It's not a scream, we think. So this thing has been modified into this terrible creature, and it's screaming in pain now. Now, Potbelly has a lot of uh, more of a happy story, but here it says, After the strange events that led to the ruins of the monster world being transferred to a realm outside of space and time, the islands we know and love were turned into Gamma Islands. Their inhabitants reborn into spectacular new forms. One such example is Kelpable, the reformed plant elemental who dazzles with a dreamy demeanor and charms with the sweetest of smiles. These stone monsters have the power to imbue life force into any plant, rejuvenating flora of all sorts and giving them means to vocalize. These sprouts tend to have strange and unique voices as a result of discovering their singing abilities for the first time so it's a lot more of a happy story than the other one but this whole island it has a weird story let's go over this one too um sent into a chronic void hydrids aqu aquatic element overwhelmed all matter and reformed monsters into new identities creating new monsters like the kind of soft ogar pipe transformed they now shimmered with the luminescence gaining the ability to manipulate water United, they became protectors of the void, their movements echoing cosmic tides through liquid currents. They coordinate a mesmerizing symphony, bringing newfound equilibrium to the Gamma Water Island and the ruins of the monster world. Also, listen to this potbelly guy, he's so cool. Kelpable, I think his name was. He's awesome. But, so this island is kind of reminds me of Gamma Water Island. I mean, it reminds me of Demented Dream Island, because you teleport monsters to that island, and then they change, they like mutate into different things. It's just like that. It's weird and it's so cool. And I can't wait to see the future of the island. But we do have other things to do today. Specifically, we need to go check out Not Sure Island because this island is one of my main focuses on this game right now. It's the reason that I'm playing it a lot and the reason that I'm spending all my resources pretty much on this island. Specifically, what I'm focusing on is getting a lot of monsters because these guys can give out diamonds and they can give out a lot of diamonds. So I'm trying to get a big farm of monsters. We have two flockas, we have two bays, we have a bunch of monsters, and we're getting more and more every single day. But of course, you've got to have all these resources. So let's quickly collect all of these resources and vortexes. I'm trying to get more vortexes. They're so rare. I never see them on my island. Like, I haven't seen one in days. I don't know what's up with that, but let's see. Do I have enough resources to craft a new monster? We do. Can it please be successful? That's a failed attempt, unfortunately. Maybe we'll have more success trying to get a rare monster. 15 diamonds? That's a success. I've never seen rare bay before, and I'm extremely excited to see what it looks like. So, we're going to speed it up, and... Oh my gosh! Wait a minute! <laughs> Look at this thing! This thing is so weird! It looks like pom pom! Because it's pink and it's like, has those eyes. And look, it has flowers on its head and it has like things coming out of it. This is so weird! Oh my gosh! This is so funny! It has like googly eyes on it. This guy doesn't even have eyes at all. I want to see what it looks like when it's doing the singing animation. But that is weird. Look at the eyes. Oh, its mouth is moving too? This thing is weird. It has like lipstick all over it. Or is that blood? I don't know. No, maybe it was like, eating blood. I don't know. But it, it's weird. Okay, this whole thing is weird. Ah, that's so cool though. Look at these flockers, by the way. I love these guys so much. They're some of my favorite monsters in the whole game. But okay, come on. I'm trying to wait to see him singing with regular bay. I want to hear them singing. Okay, I'm not waiting for all that. Let's go on to what we have next to do. What else can we do? Let me think. Let's go to... Let's go to Floating City. Because we do have something we were doing on here. And that is something that you guys might be excited for. Never mind. It's not. Because there's an hour left on it. We're going to speed it up, though. Look. I'm getting a young sponge. The reason is, is because you might know a little something about sponge in this game. And that's that if you sent it to the island called Demented Dream, it's going to turn into an evil guy, okay? It's going to turn into very, very evil, but it's okay because we need to do it because right now I actually don't have one. I used to have one, 
but I muted it on that island, and if you know what happens, you know what happens. So I lost that monster now, and I have to get a new one. So we're just gonna re-get that really quick. And Void Corn is awesome. Of course, we're talking about Void Corn. But let's send the Zeppelin on over to the Demented Dream Island. And, and if you're still watching this video, comment down below what your favorite Demented Dream Island monster is. Say, like, my favorite Demented Dream monster is... Is it Mammoth? Is it Yap? Or whatever it is. I'm expecting to see a lot of Void Corns. Which, by the way, let's get a Void Corn. I don't think I've ever gotten a Void Corn on a video. I've only gotten it on a live stream. So if you've never seen this before, it turns into nine Fur Corns. But of course, the thing about this island is that if you look away and come back, the innocence of the monsters is gone, and we have this terrible creature, and look at it. That is Void Corn, all right? I'm pretty sure we've all heard Void Corn at this point, but we can hear it for now. I'll turn up the volume a little bit, let you guys hear it. But yeah, you guys have probably seen this already. This is old news. But what might be new news to you, and is definitely new news to me, is some things that we're sorting, sort of working towards on Candy Island, because I've never gotten rare wall box in this island and i'm trying to get it currently so that's what we're working on looks like we got a cuda cane awesome now we have two open breeding structures which is great so what monsters am i missing we got toe jammer noggin kin a gum chomp we're missing flog but we're gonna get that tomorrow since it only requires 30 minutes and i'm probably gonna go to sleep a while after making this video but so there's no point in making that and then 30 minutes later it just sitting there done all night but here we go let's see who else do we not have we don't have Thrumble, okay. We don't have Thrumble, Keetra. We don't have a lot of these people. We need Thrumble. Let's get, let's get Thrumble. Actually, no, I'm pretty sure Claramel is used to get Banshee, which is something I want to get soon. I'm pretty sure that's used in the combination, so I want to get one of those so I can get that guy as soon as possible. But here we go. A, so we're going to get a Claramel. The combination is Candy, Fire, and Water. Let's remember that. Candy, Fire, Water. Candy, fire, water. Oh, I need to feed some of these monsters up. They're all so hungry. So let's go do that. Candy, fire, water. I think this guy is fire, water. So we can do that. Perfect. Head down here and do candy, fire, water. And hopefully get it first try. Come on, Fangler. Come on, Gumtromp. I love Gumtromp. Looks like we may have succeeded, may have failed. I don't know. But either way, on the other combination, I'm actually not going to try to breed a different monster. I'm going to try to breed a Gaz, which is Sprinklet and Brasket, so can I get it? I'm pretty sure that's just a Brasket, so we did not get Gaz. Um, but I'm going to need two Gaz, because I want one for the island, and then Fleetchworm also takes one. But, yeah. So, that's both the breeding structures being used. Now, what else can we do in this game? Let's think for a second. Oh, I know. We can head to Evergreen Marsh, and this is going to be something pretty cool. Oh, and by the way, look. This is Walter. You see? That's the secret monster in this game. But it's not really a monster, it's a decoration. Let me show you how to get it. Go to decorations, go to other, and then it's all the way at the right so you can get this dog decoration. It sells for 2,000 food, and it's just right there. So it's pretty weird. That's a secret in this game, but it's awesome. Anyway, Octopus, get down here on the island. We need to use this breeding structure right now. What we need it for is we need to try Corral and Yap, because, yep, yeah, we got it. Okay. My whole chat, whenever I'm streaming, tells me to do that combination and says it should take 10 seconds. So, I don't know what we're about to get. I haven't looked into it. I have no clue. We got Amphibite. That's what they were saying it was, but I don't know what it looks like. So, we got Amphibite. I don't know what this means. Oh, this is weird. This is like... What is this? Oh my gosh, this thing's weird. I've heard that it doesn't sing yet or make any sounds. So, look at it. It's like a little yellow guy and he's just sitting on those bricks. It costs zero food to feed, so we can just go ahead and feed him all the way up. Oops. We can feed him all the way up to level 20 then. And it will take zero food. Look at that. I don't think he sings. I th isn't there another secret monster in this island or something? I don't know. Because people were telling me to do a different combination on Evergreen Marsh, but I don't remember what that one was. So we'll have to try that another time. But let's see here. We, we still don't have Sponge. We don't have Del Sylvan yet. We have Bando. Let me just make sure this guy doesn't sing. Yeah, he doesn't sing. I don't think he does. So we're not missing out on anything. But we also need to get a mulch. We'll have to get that. But we're missing Dull Sylvan. We're missing Bano. No, we have Bano. We need Dull Sylvan. Okay. That's going to be Plant, Air, and Fairy. Let's go do that. Plant, Air, Fairy. Plant, Air, Fairy. Plant, Fairy, Air. Yap and Tweedle. We got, unfortunately, I think a Tweedle, so we're going to speed that up. Normally, I wouldn't speed stuff up, but it's one diamond. And we kind of have to get this right now because I don't know. Anyway, I think that's it. Maybe it's not. We'll have to figure it out whenever that's ready, though. So I'll have to wait for that. 
let's go check up on Naramba Desert. This island is very cool because you can get a lot of useful resources. You can use these things to make rare monsters on Not Sure Island, and you can also find relics on this island, which are awesome for getting Jodel, the only wordo currently in the game. Maybe there will be more in the future, though. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see for that. Also, do you guys want to see me get monsters on Tudor's Island? I kind of want to do that. Also, Terra of Organs. Can we get anybody on Terra of Organs right now? Let me see. Is there any monsters here that are on uh, Floating City? Is Clambo on Floating City? I'm going to check really quick. Oh, this is cool. Look, you can just click on this and click Islands to see which islands these monsters are on and see if any of them... Oh, but not with Ventures? You can do that with some most monsters, just not some, I guess. I don't know. That's pretty. Theramind? Well, we already have Theramind. Um, this guy, of course, is only here. Yeah, I don't think any of these guys are also on the first island. Or I feel like they should be. I don't know. Yeah, I just checked and they're they're not. So that's kind of weird because I feel like they should be. Because if they're not, how are you supposed to get them then? Do you just have to buy them with diamonds? This is a teleporting island, so I would think you teleport them. If anybody knows, please, please let me know in the comments because I would love to see how to get it. But what else can we do? What island have we not explored yet today? Let's go to the map and see. Tudor's Island, but we don't have anything there. We did Not Sure Island. We even went to Demented Dream. Of course, we did Gamma Water Island. We did Terra of Organs, Narama Desert, Candy Island, Evergreen Marsh. I, I think I can read things on Floating Cities still, so we're still not done. We gotta maximize our, our time here to progress as fast as possible. We're basically speedrunning this game, just not very good. But we need... Let's get somebody cool. Let's get young Frondly. Frondly is light, fairy, and I missed that last one. Light, fairy, and psychic. Like light, fairy, and psychic. Let's go do that and hopefully get it. Light, fairy, psychic. It looks like I'm gonna need to feed some of these monsters up right now. Can I even combine light, fairy, and psychic right now? I don't think so. Do I? Let me check. Do I have a light fairy or a light psychic? No, I don't actually. Let's get a light fairy then. Let's get Knucklehead. Light and fairy. Hopefully we can succeed and do this thing. Light, where is Flores? Flores and fairy. Flute fly. There you go. Let's see if you can get it. I believe that's a fail, so we're going to try again here. Light and fairy. Where is flute fly over here? There it is. Okay, please. I... I think that might be a success. I'm not 100% sure though. Let's just hope it is. Also, comment young Punkleton if you watch this far. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.